Hey, what up, boys? So with faith lost in Ashes of Creation, it's about time I took Asmongold's advice. There's like 50 other games. Just go play those games till this one's ready. And played a game that actually exists. Therefore, for the small, small price of $50, Pantheon Rise of the Fallen was available to play for one whole week. Yes, that's right. You don't need to spend $250 here, my friends, as Pantheon allows you to enjoy a plethora of fantasy races governed by many everquest inspired classes all set within a fantasy old school mmorpg but before we get into that our beautiful patrons and coped out the wazoo twitch subs and i would love for you to grab yourself a Kyopa Kyola, because today I'm going to be spearheading the new direction of this channel by showing you the current state of Visionary Realms Alpha MMO after 10 years of painstaking effort and feedback focused development. Now, with all that bollocks out of the way, let's begin, shall we? Nico 2 lols video. I thought Nico 2 lols video was a very good video, and I thought he had very, very good points. He didn't make me quit Ashes. Uh, well, actually, I did. I quit Ashes for Pantheon Rise of the Fallen, boys. Are you excited? Let's fucking go. Here it is. Are you excited? The thing is, I'd really like um, to change the settings um, so I can turn on the music, but I can't see the settings. We're off to a good start, right? We'll turn off the music. We'll just listen to the game ambience. It's fine. Yeah, it's just an alpha. True. Yeah, true, true, true. It is just an alpha. Sorry, yeah. Clean face. <sighs> No biased. We are going to objectively look at Pantheon Rise of the Fallen as though we have never seen the game before, and this is our first time playing it. I paid $50. I have access to this game for another four days. The first two days that I paid $50 for, I had to wait for them to give me a key for some reason. For some reason, the keys are not automatic. I had to wait two days for them to manually send me a key. So let's begin. New character. What classes have we got? Monk, and the warrior, and the cleric. Okay, we got a dagger, we got the rogue, we got a wizard with, us, with the dagger again. Um, we got an enchanter, which is the exact same class. We got a shaman with a spear. I got, I got a spear in the game. That's already more weapons than what Ashes of Creation has. That's crazy. And then a Dire Lord, which is a one-handed axe only. I mean, we gotta be a monk. I wanna go up to things. I wanna go up to those birds, and I wanna punch... I wanna grab those birds at the by the neck, and I wanna... <laughs> That's what I wanna do. So we're gonna be a monk. Oh, races, races! Oh, there's only... There's only one race. Wait, I thought there was like five races. Wait. Is it, okay, there's only one race. I can't be a female though. Wait, where's the customization? Wait, how do I customize the character? Wait, this wait, is that it? Okay, what about what about copium? Copium is free! Oh yes, okay, copium is good. Yeah, I'm a bit disappointed that there's no customization. That's a shame. Okay, boys, here we go. Okay, first impressions, first impressions. I mean it looks fine, right? I mean it looks okay. The UI is a little bit glarish. Obviously, that's maybe in design intent. It's supposed to be like that. Holy shit. Wait, F. Wait, the stream's lagging. Wait, how? How can the stream be lagging? The game is already fucking up my PC, right? This is a $10,000 PC, by the way, right? Just putting that out there. We're good now. Okay, we're good. Okay. Okay, well, first impressions is my character looks like a ma'am. It's ma'am. Excuse me, it's ma'am. It feels responsive. AD, 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 boys. I mean, hey, I can't fault them for that. It's already better than New World. The movement's responsive, right? The movement's responsive. The animation's a little bit scuffed, but sure, you can you can forgive that. It's an alpha, right? It's an alpha. Okay, this is my inventory. We'll put that down there. This is my character menu, I guess. What's this? Wandering Fist. There it is. We've got a new spell already. Off the, off the bat, off the bat, boys. Okay. Oh, I don't like the nameplates. This, they're scuffed as fuck. Actually, do you know what this reminds me of? This reminds me a lot of, of like those old Korean MMOs, like Fly for Fun. That's what the that's what this that's what the character models and this sort of nameplate reminds me. Of. It reminds me of like Fly for Fun anime style uh, old school MMOs. Okay, you said uh, I need to press C on a, on a mob before I. Uh... Okay, escape doesn't do anything. How do I bring up the game menu? I want to check my keybinds. This one, input. Okay, so I've got, to, I've got to consider mobs, right? I don't know what that means. 
Small brown rat. Here, down here, look, look at this. Small brown rat is indifferent to your presence. It would be an evenly matched fight. Okay, boys, this is it. This is it, boys, the combat. Are you ready? Here we go. One-on-one -on -one fight with a rat. There it is. Small brown rat down. Let's grind. Let's just grind, eh? Are there any quests? Wait, what do I do? Fuck yes. Wait, fire beetle hatchling is indifferent to your presence. This opponent would pose a great challenge to you. Okay, I can't use iron palm anymore. I mean, sort of... Wait, I'm dead. Wait, I'm dead already. Wait, I'm dead already. Wait, what the f... Why did I die? Wait, why did I die? You release your soul. How do I heal? Do I have any drinks? Yeah, I'll, dr I'll eat this. I got stale bread. I'm trying to consume the bread. It's not actually... It's not doing anything. How do I heal? She just have to wait. There must be like some way to eat, right? Let me check the key binds. Toggle rest. What about that? Recovering health and mana every five seconds. There it is, boys. There it is. Um, lineage 2 looks better than this. I mean... We've only just started, boys. We've only just started. Surely it gets better. Let's go fight this thing again. I'm not quite sure why I died. Uh, I'm not... Uh, did, he just, did he just crit me or some shit? Okay. Watching him. Okay, he had nothing useful. He's got nothing useful on him. I mean, the combat's... I mean, the combat's riveting. He's got... They've got no loot. I'm killing these guys. They've got no loot. Where, what's my quest? Have I got a quest? Uh, have I got a quest? What's this? You do not know me, but I have an opportunity for you. Find me near the well in the center of the village of Avelia, and I will explain more. Okay. Um, map. Map. Wait, do I not have a map? Wait, I haven't got a map. What's a map keybind? Maybe it's in my bags. The map's in my bags? No. Is there no map in this game? How am I supposed to know where the city is? I guess it's these... I guess it's here, right? It must be here, right? Houses? You learn and explore. Right. Welcome to Avalia! Hello, sir. I am looking for the well. You are looking well. No, no, sir. I am looking for a well. The NPCs are super unresponsive. Follow me. Okay, lead the way. Oh my god, look how many people there are. Will you come? Annie me out into the wilds. I am but a frail little girl, but call me ma'am. Does anyone remember why we came to the city? Uh, I've forgotten. We needed to go jump into the well, right? I'm stuck in the well. Uh, does anyone know how to get out the well? Weird. Whoa! How do you do that? I'm Spider Man. No shot, dude. Oh, that's Poggers. Wait, okay, so what do we... Wait, wait, wait. So these must be like... <gasps> wait, are there artisan skills in this game? Oh my god, there's artisan skills. I'm wondering, like, quests and shit. Quests? Hello, sir. Please lead me to the nearest fodder. I must slay them for gold. Exclamation point. Okie doke. Go, go, go. Leave me, leave me, leave me. Quest began. We need the, like, uh... The Skyrim sound effect for, for quest accepted. Oh shit, I'm sprinting! Look at that animation! On my way to purchase Pantheon Rise of the Fallen. Um, I'm lost. Where are you? I've got no map! Oh, there he is. Oh, okay, okay. This would be an evenly matched fight. I am a fully grown ma'am who's trained in the arts of being a monk using my fists as weapons. But apparently this chicken is an even match for me. <laughs> Come on in, chicken. Let's go. Epic battle. Oh, I punched the shit out of him. Holy. It's mostly auto-attacking combat. How do you make combat at the beginning of an MMO fun? Um, I mean, uh, I mean, it's, a diff it's difficult, right? It's difficult. Okay, we're going to go. We're going to go, boys. He's, he's going to take us to somewhere with a high density of mobs. But yeah, what, what do you guys think of Pantheon so far? First impressions? No hair physics. What happened to the sound? What happened to the sound? 
Weirdio, where did you go? I've lost my sound. I've lost Weirdio. I feel like I'm in the void. Oh my god, I, I, I feel compelled to open up a map. I keep pressing the map button to find where, where he's gone. He's disappeared. Wait, do you think you can swim? It's because I'm a monk, right? Therefore, the chi is in my feet and I'm standing on the water. It's like Naruto. Yeah, yeah, that's it. That's it. It's because we're monks, right? You're a monk, aren't you, weirdo? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's because we're monks. It's the famous Zen fart from Twitch chat. Invite to group. Let's go, boys. We're going out. We're an adventuring party. <laughs> Wait, there's something about three people beating the fuck out of a single snake that just cracks me up. I've got no buttons to press. I mean, it is a bit of an issue, right? That I've got no buttons to press. I think a way to make the combat more fun is to give you something to press on global cooldown, right? We leveled up, boys. We leveled up. Level two. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Okay, then. What about monsters and memories? Why would you pay thousands of dollars for this instead of monsters and memories? Because isn't monsters and memories doing the same thing, but without the without the thousand dollar price tag? Running around in circles, killing small brown rats. It's good shit. Right, listen, boys. I can't take this anymore. Yo, Cabbage. I appreciate you being here. I appreciate you healing us, but I'm done. Listen, what is Pantheon Rise of the Fallen? Is it what I expected? It is. It's exactly what I expected. However, I will say the responsiveness of the game, as in the way you move and the responsiveness of pressing the buttons, I will say are far better than what I expected. I expected it to be super clunky. I expected there to be some horrible lag or some pushing the buttons. And then in order for you to push the buttons, the game's got to go through this animation and then the animation plays and then you use your attack. I expected the game to be like that. It's not like that. It is a traditional, highly polished tab target system, just like WoW. Okay, you select something, like I get this beetle, I press a button, boom. It uses the attack instantly, boom. I use the attack instantly, boom. I use it instantly, okay? I didn't expect that, okay? It is it is responsive in the both the movement, the controls, and the combat. The problem is that there is nothing in the game. There's no races. There's no customization. The class design is very, very fucking. I don't even. I don't even understand the class design. Right. I've got this gate system, but the gate system doesn't seem to work. Apparently, I get an extra gate at level five, but I've just spent three hours pressing three buttons. Okay. You know, when it comes to games like this, obviously this can be taken as feedback if Pantheon want to listen to my opinions. You've got to take player retention into consideration. When the first three hours of your game is just pressing three buttons, you've got to consider like the long-term implications of that. If the first three hours are dog shit, then what's the next three hours going to be? And then what's the next three hours after that going to be? Is the game really going to get better? At what point does a player give up? I would have given up two hours ago, simply because my first hour was two spells. Didn't read anything, didn't understand, doesn't understand anything. I read all of my spells, I understand exactly how my class works. The problem is, is that there is no class. There is nothing here. It's, uh, it's a shell. You've got to take into consideration people's first impressions of the game. You can't just say, ye didn't read the game. You didn't read anything. You didn't read anything. There's nothing to read, mates. Whether I read this spell and understand this spell doesn't change the game mechanics. I'm still going to press the spell regardless of what it does. And that's all the feedback I've got for you. Listen, guys, it's trash, I'm afraid. For a 10-year development game, it's not a good game, okay? And it, if you say it's all because they ain't got no money, it's because they're a small team, I've, all I've got to say to you is Terraria, Valheim, or every other indie game that came before it that smashed it. It's not an excuse. I still think Pantheon is a scam, and it always was a scam and always will be a scam. It's not real. They don't intend to finish the game, and it, it, it's just the fact that we're 10 years on, and they don't even have customization, and this is what their character looks like. I don't know, I'm just trying, I'm just telling you the truth, mates.